when it comes to the most fearless and explosive point guard in all of high school basketball, this specific talented individual has really worked his way up and has truthfully been an absolute problem and nightmare for the defense. And with this great combination of his quick type change of pace and his crazy athleticism at his size, it really has put him in the upper echelon. But he also had a role model and New Jersey legend that really inspired him. This is the Elliot Cadeau story. Elliot Cadeau was born on September 4th, 2004 in Sweden, but later spent the majority of his childhood in Oradale, New Jersey. Now, during his upbringing, he played soccer, tennis, baseball, but since he was a fan of the New York Jets, he really wanted to play football, but his mother wasn't having any of it. Instead, he played flag football, and as his starting QB, he led his team to Super Bowl victories three years in a row before turning all of his attention towards basketball. That was in the fifth grade. Now, throughout his development as a kid, he was naturally a gifted passer, and truthfully, he just never looked to score. So much so to whereas his mother even had to literally pay him to shoot the basketball. Cadeau even played a tournament in Sweden with his middle school team, but went on to catch the attention of the country's national team coaches when they discovered he had Swedish heritage. And after he was invited to the national under 15 team training camp, he helped the team take first place at the 2019 North Sea Development Basketball Cup held in Denmark. And even as a young eighth grader, every gym that he played in, not only did he stand out from his crazy athleticism at such that young age, he was a true leader. As a freshman, Elliott attended Bergen Catholic High School in Oradell, New Jersey. That year, he started and held his own. But due to the COVID-19 pandemic, his season was cut short. But still, he was able to average a solid 11 points, 5 rebounds, and 4 assists a contest. He was simply a pass-first point guard and really wasn't in a rush to get his. He was a player that season who practically did everything he could to truthfully just help his team win. He led his team to an overall record of 7-2. He finished his freshman year being able to be awarded to the Max Preps Freshman All-American First Team. Now, unfortunately, Cadeau did go on to miss his whole entire sophomore season due to a high ankle sprain he suffered during a scrimmage against Gill St. Bernard School in December of 2021. But that summer, he really put on display an outstanding two-way ability while suiting up for the New Heights Lightning for the EYBL AAU circuit. As on a gamely basis, he brought it on both sides of the ball which is kind of rare to see when it comes to highly ranked guards. Elliot never shied away from just bringing that dog and scrappy type play style. The reads he were able to make, no doubt, made him stand out by far. A lot of the things he was doing were stuff that you just really can't teach. For that summer alone, he really demonstrated on how a true point guard should operate. Nobody had an answer for his quick first step as Elliott was able to get to anywhere on the court whenever he wanted to and was definitely one of, if not the best, in the whole entire league when it came to just simply setting up each of his teammates with so much ease. He simply played out of his mind and not a lot of guards in his class had that knack on knowing where each of his teammates would be at all times. His stellar play allowed him to earn a plethora of offers with North Carolina and Kansas being some of his top schools. In his official junior year, the six foot two five star dynamic point guard made the transfer into the Link Academy in Branson, Missouri, where he is the 13th best ranked prospect in the class of 2024 but has also signed to play college basketball at North Carolina. Now, with Elliott already being 18 years old and having one more year of high school left, he has the opportunity to reclassify up into the class of 2023. Now, Elliott is the first high school basketball player ever in the US with the international NIL deal with the Swedish company Flow Life, as well as a deal with Rock Nation. Elliott Cadeau undoubtedly carved his way up into being a top tier talent and made a lot of sacrifices along the way, but always had a crazy high basketball IQ that really put him in a league of his own. Yeah, I just try to stay positive on and off the court. I just want to be like a professional NBA player. I don't want to um, grow up regretting, like um, knowing that I could have been better than I was. And I just want to reach my potential. 
And with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, this is the Elliot Cadell story.